The stability of a protein plays an important role in everything from expression to purification, formulation, and storage. So let's say you want to measure protein stability. How do you go about doing that? Most likely you're going to use a technology like differential scanning calorimetry, circular dichroism, or differential scanning fluorimetry, also known as thermal shift assay or thermofluor. But let's face it, all of these techniques have their limitations. Differential scanning calorimetry requires high sample consumption. Circular dichroism only works in limited buffer conditions, and differential scanning fluorimetry requires a fluorescent dye for detection. Of these, differential scanning fluorimetry, or DSF, is very popular because it takes quick measurements and is also suitable for high throughput applications. However, the requirement for fluorescent dyes greatly reduces its range of applications. DSF is also not suitable for large molecules, membrane proteins, or high concentration samples that are common in formulation development. So what if you want to get high quality data with native proteins over a broad range of conditions and do it in a high throughput setting? The Prometheus NT48 with Nano DSF technology is an instrument for measuring ultra high resolution protein stability and unfolding. With Nano DSF you can investigate both thermal and chemical unfolding of your samples. Most importantly, it allows you to run samples that cannot be assessed with existing methods. With the Prometheus NT48, you get a dye-free technology that measures the intrinsic tryptophan and tyrosine fluorescence of native proteins. There are no buffer restrictions. You can perform nano-DSF even in the presence of detergents. It's more sensitive, so you can detect multiple, even minute, unfolding events that are not detected with standard methods. The low input sample requirements means you can get high-quality data even with very little sample. In fact, the broad concentration range lets you use between 5 micrograms per mil to over 200 mg per mil of sample. The capillary format lets you measure highly viscous samples that cannot be analyzed by any other technique. How does the Prometheus NT48 work? You start by filling a capillary with a few microliters of your protein solution and loading it onto the Prometheus NT48. You can load up to 48 samples in a single run. Next, you select a temperature ramp between 0.1 degrees Celsius per minute to 5 degrees Celsius per minute. As the sample chamber ramps up to the preset temperature, the instrument continuously reads fluorescence at both 330 and 350 nanometers. Thermal denaturing of a protein is visualized and melting temperatures are automatically calculated. Which applications can benefit from the robust data quality and unique advantages of Prometheus NT48? Antibody engineering, membrane protein research, formulation development, and quality control. Pharmaceutical laboratories that develop therapeutic antibodies, for example, routinely look at protein stability in order to find optimal formulation conditions for long-term stability. Prometheus NT48 is the ideal choice for stability screening during the entire cycle of antibody development, from the early stages when sample is limited, to the final formulation screening with highly concentrated and viscous samples. The fact that you can use the same method at every step with native protein makes this technology even more desirable. Here you can see thermal unfolding profiles for antibodies A, B, and C generated on the Prometheus NT48. The data clearly shows two unfolding events for antibodies B and C, but three distinct unfolding events for antibody A. This level of data resolution allows you to study the effects of buffers, excipients, or covalent modifications on the stability of individual antibody domains. On the Prometheus NT48, you can achieve this with just a few micrograms per mil of sample. In contrast to standard technologies, the Prometheus NT48 is uniquely suited for biophysical characterization of integral membrane proteins, which are generally available in limited quantities and require detergents to remain solubilized. Here we see the unfolding profiles of a transmembrane helix protein, telluride resistance protein A, in the presence of eight different detergents. The data generated on the Prometheus NT48 shows as much as a 30 degree difference in TMs across this set of detergents. Thanks to nano DSF technology, scientists can now find the optimal purification and storage conditions for membrane proteins and other proteins that need detergents for stability. The next time you want to look at the thermal or chemical stability of your protein, consider how much more you can do with the Prometheus NT48.